Hi, Steve Adams here, and I want to talk about who should I see if I think I have anxiety? Well, this is a huge problem. You know, and one of the challenges with anxiety is, is it doesn't really affect tomorrow. It really saps our energy and our strength today. And listen, I have it periodically when I have, you know, business conditions or family situations that cause stress. But we're talking about something that's beyond just stress of the day. Um, according to the National Institute of Health Study, 31% of adults, that's like 31 million people in America, struggle with this problem at some point in their lives, which means you are not alone. Um, the thing you should know, there's kind of four levels. Uh, there's mild anxiety, there's moderate anxiety, there's severe anxiety, and then there's a more severe, and that's a panic level anxiety. These levels are based on the level of distress and impairment that they cause your day, okay? And so what I want to do in this uh, video is talk about uh, ways to get help rather than trying to avoid treatment or trying to self-diagnose and treat, okay? So we're going to talk about three things in this video. One is the problem of anxiety. Number two is approaches to anxiety. Number three is how Tiger Medical approaches anxiety as a whole, all right? So first, think through the level of anxiety that you may have. It's not vital to be perfectly accurate, but the better that you can describe how you feel your symptoms, the more that a professional can help you, okay? As I said before, this has become a very common problem in society. There's not a stigma with it. Don't be afraid to go seek help, all right? You know, we're tethered to our devices. We're always available, we're always on. There's a lot of things that are driving this in our modern culture, also including poor nutrition. So um, the other statistic that's in there is that anxiety tends, based on the data, to affect more women than men. Uh, so. It's important, please seek help on this, all right? So what are some of the approaches? Well, number one, go to your primary care provider. If you have a primary care doctor who knows you, this is a great first place. They're gonna assess you. They're gonna help understand what level maybe. They can also refer you to a mental health professional, okay? Or they may be able to prescribe something for you as well if you wanna go that route. Um, a psychiatrist or psychologist is gonna be more specialized in this area. They're gonna be able to very accurately assess, you know, clinically what level of anxiety you're at, and then either through prescription drugs or ongoing therapy or both have a plan for you. If you really want to avoid that kind of a scenario, then the other option is a functional or integrative medical approach that will involve a very extensive intake process, understand all of your medications, your lifestyle habits, your life circumstances, your health history, and then there'll be a testing approach that'll delve deeper into all the different systems of your body or many of them, you know, in a very holistic approach to try to find the root cause or the underlying mechanisms for the way you feel that you feel today, okay? Um, functional doctors do not typically have payer restrictions, so they're gonna be able to do more testing if you've got the budget for it uh, and really get to the bottom line. What you're gonna find in this approach too, and this is, we do this at Tiger Medical, is diaphragmic breathing combined with sleep optimization, combined with daily movement. To begin with, the three things together can have a significant positive impact on anxiety symptoms. Um, additionally, extensive testing, particularly of your gut biome and genetics can provide additional clues. And these are the kind of things that Tiger Medical does. And so. Let me finish up with what we do at Tiger Medical. It's really, it comes down to three things. One, we do testing so we are not guessing. Number two, we customize what we do, okay, based on your unique set of biomarkers and gene genetics. And then we partner you with the doctor and a health coach to make changes that will help address your anxiety. We're very successful in addressing this issue. We've helped people with anxiety. We've helped somebody clear up 10 years of panic attacks where they get none anymore. And it was a multi-factor solution. It was genetics, it was gut biome, it was lifestyle habits, and it was the implementation of our eight tiger health habits that was able to unlock that key for this person. So next steps, really two things. One, you can go to our website and book a health assessment if you're ready to talk to a professional today. If you're not, go to our learning center and look around at stress and anxiety articles, look at the solutions section and you know, learn more about our approach and and then take that next step, but do something. If you never work with us and this just spurs you to take action, do that and get help. Thank you. I hope this was helpful.